What's up guys, the owner AD rapping a song right there all the way from Cape Town. You're watching the weekend turn. Schedule a busy, you know that I'm ready. Can fuck out a petty, you jelly. I see they fall like confetti. When I'm on a road, man, I move like a Chevy. I put a lock on my money. Have I always had a passion for music? Um, I wouldn't necessarily say in the beginning it was a passion, it was more of a interest. Interest because at the time I never would have ever thought I would pursue music because it's something that hasn't been influenced in my family or I have no like background into music. So um, yeah, like I just had a calling for it and a friend of mine, he was a DJ and he uh, asked me if I should open the beat because he just found out he was producing. And I just freestyled something and then it just sounded so cool. And from that day, I just like took it serious. And that was like five years ago, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, and from that day, I just took it and I focused on it 100% every day. And yeah. I'm on hooks like the pirate squad. It's 150 degrees. 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 I'm the hottest they ever. Um, first inspiration, it was so I am the only child from my mother's side, so. I used to like write a lot of music, um, just write it and put it in a five, like a file down. And it was five years ago, and I just like thought of just writing something because I never, I never used to like. I'm an introvert, first of all, so I used to just write things and I just repeat it. Like I used to print out Drake lyrics and just say it to myself, see if I can like do it in that way, and yeah. And it's, I would say about five years ago, like from Drake's music, that really inspired me. Don't fuck with it till I drop heat on your head. I fuck up the game like a virgin. You people be making me nervous. Two years ago, 2018, I opened up for Nasty C. That was like the best performance. And I only performed like one song at the time. <laughs> Yo, like that was like the vibe, the energy. Um, yeah, it was really like intrigue. And people like, when I got off stage, people were like, coming up to me and wanted to take a picture and yo, it was just, it was just a really memorable and something I'll never forget because that's something I really strive towards. They don't want no gas, I'm on big smoke. There's no cap, I'm on lock, it's a beast mode. Uh -huh. They know when I'm talking, it's a G-code. Shots in them ticket, it's not a free throw. No, 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 it's too much on the line. I just heard that my grandfather and his brothers had like a band yeah, so I didn't know, but I only found out like a month ago, and yeah, it was very interesting. But my cousin can play guitar, but there wasn't like a necessary like an influence on me that that took me and decided, look, okay, I wanted to pursue music. It's just something that I really love, and I really love doing. I have a passion for it, and yeah, I really enjoy it. What's the point of even talking to me? I had to show them what I made all before I hop on the beat. I'm hot like playing to the studio, nigga, man. What do you see? I'm a G, so why you I definitely want to take it into an international stage and I definitely see myself going into not just music but also like doing my own brand and doing movies and modeling as well so I want to venture into a lot of things not just music I want to like have my own business label so yeah, I definitely see myself doing that. In the in the process that I am now, I am like discover, still discovering my sound and still growing as an artist. But I always strive to do better than my previous work, and that's why the the sound scheme that I have now is way different than I sound like in say two or three years ago. So I definitely definitely want to make some hits, some like crazy hits, some crazy collaborations. Cause that's definitely what I want to do. Um, people that I would love to work with locally, I would say Nasty C. He's obviously like a big influence on me, and I feel I, yo, I really resonate with his music. Uh, international, I'd say Drake. Drake for sure. Like he's when I first heard his music, like it was crazy. Cause I was when I grew up, I was listening to a lot of R and B. Asha, um, Luther Vandross. So yeah, I used to love that sort of sound. And then when he came into the game, he was like singing and rapping. I was like, this is crazy. And yeah, from that day, like I'd say Drake for sure.
Yeah, I want to say a major shout out to Shaney J. Like we just, we just cleared out a whole uh, collaboration tape that was doing some crazy vibes. You guys definitely should check that out. Like got some like R&B, we got some tropical vibes, hard rap, trap, yo, it's crazy. So definitely want to shout out Shaney J. What up, it's the Only 80. You've just watched the weekend turn up, and shout out to Sports Team for having me. Love y'all. Not a one body in the dust, shawty be keeping me up They really tell now they tough, yeah uh -huh. I'm about to tell them what's up, I'm never giving it up